the 14th of April, 1912. A night to remember. A night when the largest, most luxurious liner of her day was speeding across the North Atlantic on her maiden voyage. No expense had been spared to make this ship a symbol of man's final victory over nature. Her first class passengers were the very cream of society. The aristocrats from Europe and millionaires homeward bound to America. In the steerage class, everyone enjoyed their own kind of boisterous fun. Then there were the second class passengers and the crew. 2,208 happy, confident people speeding across a flat, calm sea in a ship that everyone knew was unsinkable. Absolutely unsinkable. The ship was called the Titanic. What did you see? Iceberg, get ahead, sir! Kenneth Moore, whose warm, compelling sincerity holds him high in the hearts of cinema goers all over the world as Lightoller, the second officer on a ship whose destruction shook the very foundation of man's progress and marked the end of an era. How many people are there on board? 2,200 or more. And room in the boats for... How many? 1,200. This is the epic drama of the greatest disaster in the history of the sea. Goodbye, my dear son. No! 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 What are you doing? No! 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 Here, for the first time, is the story of that night. A night when 2,200 men, women and children were faced with a terrible fact. The fact that most of them were going to die. No work of fiction could ever contain such incredible twists of fate or leave such terrible questions unanswered to haunt the mind. Why did that last ice warning never reach the captain? What happened on the ship that stopped within sight of this struggle with death but didn't save a single life? No writer of thrillers could ever achieve such agonizing suspense. Sir! Sir! What the devil's going... Haven't you learned to knock before you come in here? It's a distress call, sir, from the Titanic. She's sinking. Carpathia, sir. She's making 17 knots and should be with us about 3.30. That'll be too late. Anniversary. God bless her. Wish her a happy anniversary from me. Oh, thank you. Our mum is a very special person. You, ma'am, tell her happy birthday from the lads. It's not her birthday, it's her anniversary. Happy anniversary, then. We invite you to join the family on this happy occasion. Oh, how we danced on the night we were wed. We bought our true love. Elegant. Charming. No one in sight is a patch on our mum. Bloody hell. Happy anniversary, God! What kind of a woman do you think I am? She's the incomparable Betty Davis. And there's no one to hold a candle to her. You know, it's this house, this bloody house. I always leave here with a screaming headache, shaking with murder and hate. Her loving daughter-in-law. Her three adoring sons. And her prospective daughter-in-law. 
What is it, love? What's the matter? Henry's here. He's dressed himself up in my clothes. Get that stuff off, Henry. You know nylon brings you out in a rash. God bless our mum. God bless our happy home. It's you. Me? You're inside him all the time, scratching away at his ulcer. Ah, that's more like my daughter-in-law. Down on all fours, spitting away, with her whiskers quivering. Betty Davis, brilliant star of many parts, adds yet another portrait of evil to her gallery of memorable characters. I heard you summed up the moment you poked your head out. This one's a Thomas, I said, and I was right. Mum is always right. That is why we decided to do something really special for her on this anniversary. What do you suggest, Karen? Put her on a bonfire, tie her to a stake. No more games. This time we really kill her. My God, she's scummy. We find that our love is an altar. God, you've had a good anniversary, haven't you? It's not over yet. us if you dare into a twilight world of unspeakable horror you must die everybody must die <laughs> sample if you dare the deadly passion of the vampire lovers <laughs> Perverted creatures of the night find their victims everywhere. The unsuspecting merrymakers in glittering ballrooms with their young and tender throats. The sleeping beauties whose troubled dreams turn into real terrifying nightmares. For God's sake, save her! their evil hearts are still for all eternity. If one remains, yes, even one, there will be thousands more. Beware. Beware the cold caress, the kiss that kills. Beware the vampire lovers. Everyone knows there are two sides to the infamous Dr. Jekyll. By day, the man. By night, the monster. Put a woman in your life, a good woman, and one day you'll wake up and you'll see a, a changed man. Now, Hammer believe you too are ready for a change. An absolutely complete change. <laughs> This is the testament of Dr. Henry Jekyll. Male. 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 It's Hyde, isn't it? 
Uh, how is your brother? He hasn't been himself of late. This is the new Dr. Jekyll, the most evil woman you'll ever see. This is the sensuous Sister Hyde, the most evil man you'll ever meet. Stay away from her. She means you great harm. But why? I just feel it, that's all. Dr. Jekyll, Sister Hyde, man or woman, or both. In this film, you will actually see the sinister Dr. Jekyll change in mind and body into the totally evil Sister Hyde. It is I who exist, Dr. Jekyll, not you. It is I who will be rid of you. Rid of you! Rid of you! Hammer invites you to share the agony of a man whose body is possessed by a strange passion to murder and beyond. They must be female, no more than 20 years old. There will be a different kind of victim tonight. And then the tug of war will be ended between us. Fascinating situation, don't you think? It'll be interesting to see who wins. Come to the asylum. Come to the asylum. To get killed. to the asylum. Yes, I think the time has come to take violence toys away from you. To get killed. <laughs> come to the asylum. <laughs> to get killed. Asylum. Now you hurry and get dressed, and I'll go down the hall and... Uh... Asylum, starring Peter Cushing, Britt Eklund, Herbert Lom, Patrick McGee, Barry Morse, Barbara Parkin, Robert Powell, Charlotte Rampling, Sylvia Sims, Richard Todd, James Villiers. Asylum. <laughs> Asylum. The most exciting film you'll ever see. <laughs> of horror. 